something that uh, something I just wanted to show here as these birds are, are gathering around me is it's very important for you to look uh, from your birds at your birds from the top as well I think uh, it, you know it's it's really easy for people to um, just be kind of get into looking at birds from the side and that's oftentimes what a lot of a lot of people that post uh, photographs of their birds uh, what they focus on is the side and that's because it's pretty easy to <laughs> go up and take a picture of the side of a bird but one of the things as I mentioned that I'm really working on is the the depth of the or the width of the body I want to have a broad a very broad a broad bird. I want my birds, uh, one of the things I'm going for is to have my birds uh, become wider and not taller, uh, which would be lend them to more rangy tendencies, which means kind of a, a long drawn out body that's, uh, that's unfortunately I think skinnier than what I like, uh, what I'm looking for in my hamps here. So um, one of the things that I actually measure when I'm going through and culling birds uh, that are older than this is I actually take measurements of um, with a uh, with a, a seamstress uh, tape I actually take measurements for how many inches wide their um, their back is and how long their their keel is and um, getting that width is really important and actually taking the width of the body itself and not getting caught up in the feathers um, is something that we want to do. Um, you can see this male here. Look at how look how nice and wide his his body is here. Um, versus there was another male here that was walking around. Well, versus this this guy right here. Um, you know, there's oh here they here they're right next to each other. This bird is a lot more wide than that bird, and um, that's one of the things that I'm kind of going for in my birds is I'm, I'm not kind of going for I am going for is getting that body wide um, short and stout I guess is kind of where I'm shooting for here so that's going to give those those meat production type qualities that I'm really looking for so I get a beautiful looking uh, broiler carcass on the table uh, out of my out of my coals and I keep the best and eat the rest